feel like I look better when I'm further away and like in the dark and like if you close your eyes Good morning, it's 2 o'clock It's breakout season I have two new pimples Well, big ones I'm naming them Bob and Ross Okay uh, Sorry, I kicked you Okay, okay uh, Okay, okay, okay I look rough Girl Uh, hi uh, okay, 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 well, welcome back to the channel <laughs> Welcome back to the channel. It's your favorite piece of trash here. Excuse my voice. Um, I Haven't talked in like two days. So I've just been watching TikTok, 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 TikTok Today we're gonna be doing a boring ass video. I actually thought this was super boring, so I never did it. I did it once, okay? Don't be digging up dirt on me, saying I'm a liar and shit. Uh, I did do it once because I was really emo and I was going through it. And I was like, I need an excuse to talk about my issues with someone that's not my therapist. So I um, did a video where I got ready and ranted about things. Are you, is it even focused on me? Actually, it's probably a good idea if it's not focused on me. I'm sitting before you today filming a get ready with me i don't know i just always thought this was really boring and never wanted to do it but i put up a poll and apparently you really wanted to see me get ready stalker so i'm gonna get ready and film myself so you can watch a stranger on the internet get themselves ready on hindsight okay i mean okay honestly when we were younger we used to learn about like the dangers of the internet and shit like don't post too much information on the internet and whatnot um I'm doing exactly that. You know how my room looks like? You know who I am? You know where I live? Anyways, YOLO, right? Yes. What do I have planned for today that I'm getting ready for? You might ask. Might you? I don't know. Okay, for someone who can't talk, I talk a lot. I need to shut up. Anyways, continuing to talk. I'm not doing anything because we're still all in quarantine. As you know, you might not know. Okay, well, I'm telling you. I just thought it would give you a little bit of like insight to like my makeup routine it's hot as shit should i ask my dad if i can turn on the air conditioning again he might kill me but like i kind of want to die dad yeah. can I turn on the air conditioning i'm filming he said no i'm running away oh it's so hot it's so hot i'm sweating i'm running away so I was just gonna film some TikToks. So that's what we're getting ready for, okay? We're gonna film some TikToks, okay? I'm sorry. It's just who I am. I'm a TikToker now. Accept me, okay? So we're just gonna vibe and have fun while I do my makeup and it's gonna be a good ass time. I have pimples and this one looks like it's gonna, it's gonna be a big one. It's gonna be a big boy. Should I gender stereotype my pimples? It's gonna be around for a while. So. I don't know if I'm necessarily gonna put concealer on because I don't want to clog that shit and make make him make her make it bigger than it has to be. I have Mount Everest on my face, and I'm not sure any amount of makeup would actually fix that because concealer covers redness, but like, does it cover a mountain? No. I'm gonna start with uh, my concealer. Anyways, this is the L'Oreal Paris Infallible Footwear More Than Concealer Concealer. It's just concealer. I don't know why they say more than concealer. It's it's just concealer. I'm gonna be putting it under my eyes, but I'm trying to avoid my little my little friend here, my pal. I'm just scared that if I cover up those little guys, they're gonna get angry and then they're gonna come back with more of their friends. Do I have to? TikTok has like a beauty filter, right? They like cover them for you. Honestly, I feel like TikTok makes me look so much nicer than I do in real life, which is why I spend so much time on this app. But at the same time, I feel like my self-esteem just plummets on TikTok. Having fun on TikTok. <laughs> I'm just seeing a bunch of girls on TikTok with perfect bodies and perfect faces. And well, my face looks... You know what my face looks like. I don't like wearing foundation. It's Especially when I'm doing TikToks because I sweat a lot doing TikToks probably because I'm dancing I sweat because my body is just like telling me to stop um, embarrassing myself on the internet It basically- ow! Ow! Okay, I just bit my lip Basically my body sees me dancing terribly and then it starts crying so I sweat a lot when I dance And then my skin is just like You're giving us more than we can drink, you know? And then Yeah, okay, I just get pimples when I sweat. Yep, this is the look guys. Thank you for watching. Um, come back next week. 
I kind of hurt it though. I look white. This was way too much concealer. <laughs> I look like a piece of paper. I don't know why you guys wanted to see my makeup routine. As if you guys thought I did it well. If I was famous, I would be under fire for um, white face. Spill shit. <laughs> Spill sesh. Where's the video about me? I'm waiting for my controversy. I don't know why I'm talking about tea pages, but I've just been watching a lot of drama channels recently. I don't know why. Should we do contour next so I look less white? Yes. In case you missed that last video, um, if you did, that's so disrespectful. Go watch it. This is a Revlon palette. I've had it since like I was born. I'm just kidding. I've had it since I was like 13. I'm 18. That's basically since I was born. Looking real crusty. You want to say hi to yourself? That's you. My mom got these. <laughs> Having the same makeup palette since I was 13 and using it for 5 years does not sound like a good idea. But it has no expiration date. So if there's no expiration date, it doesn't expire. Like I said in the last video, I don't know what shade to use for contour, so I just use this part of it. We're gonna take shade brown area. And we're gonna put it on my face. We're just gonna contour my cheekbones out. I was born with really fat cheeks. And not the good kind of fat cheeks. That looks terrible, but what are you gonna do, right? Make the best of it. Live, laugh, love. I have a huge ass forehead. I've talked about it in my other videos. Basically, I tried to have bangs to cover up my huge ass forehead, but all bangs gave me was depression and acne. So this is going really terribly. I don't trust the process. I'm telling myself it's okay, but deep down I know it's not gonna be okay. Should I just apply it all over my face? Like contour my whole face? Is that a vibe? You guys, are you guys vibing with me? No? Yeah. Me neither. We're gonna take a lighter shade then. Ross, get back in there. What are you doing out? Ross, I'm gonna blend it out. I hate using makeup sponges because I just feel like it's dirty and like disgusting. I am lazy to wash them. And like, not like I never wash them. I wash them sometimes, but I just feel like a lot of dirt gets on it. It looks brown right now. It's not moldy. It's a little moldy. There's some like good types of mold out there, right? Anyways, I'm getting ahead of myself. I'm not Bill Nye the science guy. Then I'm gonna recontour my face again because at this point I just might make it worse. <clears throat> Excuse me. If I was like a well-known YouTuber, I would just literally tweet and get that was traumatizing. Where I would literally just tweet and then get a topic to talk about in like 10 minutes but my twitter has like probably 10 followers this is the silky girl photo sharp contour and highlight stick i really want to get like real with you guys like tell you guys some personal shit but honestly i'm in a very happy place right now i don't know what to tell you i guess school's been really hard i don't really fit in with anyone like i'm not saying that just to be like quirky but like no i just don't i don't know i just feel like i'm trying too hard with literally everybody that looks like Something I cannot say on this channel without getting demonetized. Maybe it's something wrong with me. Maybe I'm the problem. Conspiracy theory. But I just don't feel like I do anything really bad to anyone. Well, okay, I've had my sh fair share of like mistakes. Everyone makes them. As long as you uh, admit to it and as long as you take responsibility for it and you're trying to change, I feel like that just means you're growing, which is good. You can't expect people to like, like immediately just move past everything. If you messed up with them, you messed up with them, you know? Um, don't expect them to forgive you or whatever, like it's their choice. But like I'm very grateful to the people who have still decided to stick by my side despite watching me mess up and want to see me grow and want to be on that journey with me as I become a better person from my mistakes. I just feel like there's a difference between not wanting to like accept someone's apology and like I get that. But it's another thing to like purposely want to spread hate or like ruin their reputation or whatever like that's that's just kind of immature like literally said that they're doing all this just to get a reaction out of me because they want that reaction okay that's just that's just weird i'm doing i'm using my peri para speedy skinny brow brow pencil because we're on to brow but if you feel like you're in a situation where you can't fit in know that you're not alone me, Bob, and Ross are behind you. I don't know what to tell you. I just look really bad. I look really bad. Okay. 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 I got this as a birthday present. It's by Novo. This pink shade over here. They're all pink. I use this shade over here. <sighs> Honestly, mm, I look like I have pink eye. I feel like I'm very grateful to have gotten hate. That makes sense. If you know me, you know I had a really rough 
time growing up and I got a lot of hate like since I was in kindergarten I used to be bullied by this girl who I follow on Instagram today so you know bullying is only in the moment after you graduate you will literally never think about it ever again a lot of people just find reasons to be negative and find reasons to spread that negativity like if you don't like someone move along to be fair like in their defense I was a very annoying kid I mean I'm kind of annoying now okay like really annoying kind of um really annoying i'm glad that i was treated the way that i was treated no matter how rough it was no matter how many times i wanted to freaking like kill myself it really shaped me into who i am today and it really shaped me into like having values i feel like if i was one of the ones like laughing at other people i feel like i'll be really sad like now like now that i don't have anyone to shit talk <laughs> i have a lot of empathy for people who are treated the same way and like if i don't like someone for the most part as much as I can, I try to just shut up about it, like not talk about it and move on with my life because I don't want to, first of all, I don't want to spend time talking about somebody that I hate, like why would I do that? Why would I waste my time? You know, I don't want to influence other people's opinion on them because they might piss me off but like they probably won't piss like another person off I don't want to like ruin that for them because I know what that feels like, I would never do that to somebody and I also feel like I am pretty good at like handling situations now that involve hate this is what the eye i'm way too close to you i'm getting too comfortable like who am i this is what the eye look looks like right now i'm covering my face because i don't want you to get a good look at ross like i don't i will i've said it before and i will say it again i don't know why you guys asked for a makeup tutorial as if i can do makeup i kind of want to do something like adventurous today a little bit should i no oh my gosh no that was traumatic a lot of asian girls i see put like eyeshadow at the bottom of their eyes and i thought it'd be like oh my god like that'll be a fun cute idea like let's be adventurous no the eyeliner i'm using is liquid ink by essence it's not good i don't recommend it it's so like liquidy like okay it's liquid liner like i'm not dumb but like i'm a little bit dumb but like if i were to just go like like this like pat it a little bit like it would just it'll just fly off of the wind like i haven't had the chance to buy a proper like liquid liner and like i've been kind of broke so like um my bank account details are so we're gonna take the liquid liner and put it on my eyeball 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 that's not, that's not where where it's supposed to go don't that's do not that. don't do that don't please do that. don't do that okay how i do my liner i feel like since this is a tutorial i just feel like since this is a why was I born with a mouth if I couldn't use it? Because I know a lot of people have been asking me that on the DMs. I'm filming. I'm so Do you want to say hi? Who? My friends. That's my mom. Oh, hello. <laughs> Where's everybody? They're gonna be watching. Oh, not yet. No, no. <laughs> She's so cute. I don't know how to show you without completely messing up. I'm gonna put them. I'm too close. That's uncomfortable. I didn't even notice that. Thanks for pointing it out. Why is there a fly in my room? Get out. You're not welcome here. From the like halfway of my eye. They're Asian. Okay, so I like to So I like to start from the middle and pull my way up like that. And then I like to go here. And then we just color it in. Color within the lines, kids. Anyways, if you're not subscribed, please subscribe. Because I was looking at my analytics. 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 And like if you close your eyes, is it even? Um, absolutely not. But is it good enough for TikTok? Hell yeah. So what am I gonna do next? That's a very good question, Hannah. I don't know. I'm gonna be doing lashes next because I just need to get something on my eyes to make them less bald. They're by House of Lashes. They're called Serene Light. Lashes can honestly drastically change your appearance. Like I used to not believe in them, but holy crap, like as long as I put it on, I'm a completely different person. Like when I put on lashes, I turn into a girl. Like I start freaking giggling and shit. Who the heck giggles? Um, I like these because they look so natural and this is like an everyday makeup tutorial So we're gonna we're gonna be using them. Yep. That's how I look with lashes on. We're gonna Put this bad boy on now Hit it from the back <laughs> Whoa, that was scary. You guys can't even see what's happening, but that was scary. I'm just telling you hollow top prisma 
Hyper Cosmos, whatever that is, in number 10. I like the holographicness of it. It just comes off very easily, it wipes off. So this and my sweat is not a good combination. So I usually put too much of it before I leave the house. So I'm gonna use my Matte Junkie by Silky Girl. Honestly, one of my favorite lipsticks. But um, it's running out, so it's gonna be an issue. And I'm broke, so that's gonna be a bigger issue, so. My bank account details are, so we're gonna put a little bit on top. Kinda make that into like an oval almost, if that makes sense. We're doing TikToks anyway, my hair's gonna get sweaty, so probably just gonna break the front and then leave it. <laughs> okay, now I'm gonna do my other side. We're really out here, here out, out, out here in the, out here in the here out. So I'm gonna put these two braids back and tie it together. It had more potential than this. This is a completed look. I'm gonna pick out some good TikTok clothes now. Okay, this is the transformation. This is my everyday makeup tutorial. Probably without the lips, actually. I hate putting on lip makeup, but everything else is pretty much the same. I feel like if I curled it, it'll be cuter, but I don't wanna fry my hair off, so. Just girly things when she fries her hair off. <laughs> I'm still ugly, but thank you for watching. Have a good day, have a good night. Um, I'm gonna film some TikToks now. Bye. See, I giggle. I swear to God, I turn to a different person. Okay. Bye. Hee <laughs> hee. It's not turning off.